Hey, what's the deal, Sagittarius? Hope you enjoyed your day. You will have a good day. All you have to do is set your mind to a good day. This could be you having conflict within yourself about your love life or about your work, but you know you have conflict around you. If you didn't know, you know now. Uh, people are getting the courage to speak up for themselves with that Leo energy. Yes. Intimacy is in reverse. So these people are not getting to know each other and they're probably picking on each other by petty things because they have no empathy. So they fighting and arguing about petty shit. Children in reverse. So children is not affecting your love life. Maybe you don't have kids. Maybe your kids are grown. Or maybe you got your shit together when it comes to your kids. Religious factors. Is why people want to drain your energy. You probably give these people compliments. You probably actually listen when these people are talking. Okay? And that's enough to get someone to really like you. Yes, you're getting people in their water energy or you have a water sign that wants to be an energy vampire because your religion's factors, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. It could be the opposite earth. Earth could be in their feelings. If it's not their energy, these people refusing to go the right direction. These people refusing to put the work in with that one. And what you see about these people when it comes to their love and passion and things with that black that you didn't think you know knew it was being a mystery yeah you see they using their one or their private parts in the wrong way yeah separation is in reverse this separation came in reverse these people can't love and gaslight yes now is the best time yes it is they came in reverse for you to be getting that money or selling on to uh, more peace and calm waters, even when it comes to that money. <clears throat> so the so you can have a people you can have people at your job, uh, people around you that are attracted to you that's not getting to really know you, probably looking at you like an object with that uh, intimacy in reverse. Intimacy is when you're trying to get to know someone or there's more passion. So you can have people fighting themselves or fighting with each other or having animosity among each other because they all like you. And maybe they're friends or they work together or they act like they're friends, whatever. But once again, friend, they can't put no love spell on you. You're a triple threat. You not stand optimistic and you don't feel like you have to get shit done. <laughs> These people have no patience, and patience is love, you know? Because they see you not a simp. You're not doing shit for no one that don't appreciate you. So whoever wants to marry you, or whoever uh, marriage is in reverse, why you over here waiting for your shifts to come in? Yeah, these people have codependent issues. And they try to act like they know what they're talking about when they don't. Yeah, they have no, you know, uh, mind, body, and soul. To me, this can also mean 20. Judgment. So these people are not using their intuition. That's why they're not getting shit in life. They're not having heart-to-heart -heart talks, not just with people, but with their fucking self. And they bitching about shit that doesn't mean anything. Earth, water, energy. And this earth energy could be foundation, structure, relationships. Anything that they need to have to have solid ground. That's why they have no independence and self-realization. Whoever this relationship or earth energy is that they're messing with. Earth. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn in reverse. They need to get it together. Hope you had a good day. Like I said earlier, like and subscribe. Let me know what's on your mind. Honey, honey. Community uh, board or description box. Leave me some comments if this resonates with you or not. 
But that's what you have going on around you. <sighs> I took this out earlier. Sorry, y'all. <laughs> Give me a minute. Thank y'all for the new subscribing and subscribers. And of course, my old ones. Thank you for the referrals and doing um, energy reads with me. I've been Cadillacing, cooking. So let's get it together. With the uh, root chakra, it's what you're in. You ready to get those feet moving? Remember, you're in the three of wands, sitting around, waiting on things to come your way. Both in your body as well as the physical world. Physical plane. Stimulates passion and supports our sense of security on the physical plane. Support our security. As long as we're going to get shit done or even try T-R-Y, you'll come up with something. Compassion. It has to be in your heart to want to do it. Love can flow from source through our heart and into the world with realization. Process of becoming our highest expression in the world. Becoming aware of heart centered truth as well as the external process of being becoming our highest expression of the world highest expression of the world all these people are fighting about nothing cuz they're not independent and have no self realization let's see where this love is falling at can't express myself. That's what's wrong with these people. <laughs> I want to be a different. I want to be different. You triggering people. They can't promise you nothing because they don't trust themselves. You know, I don't have that saying that. You know how some people say, I don't know what I would do. I know what the fuck I would do. I don't know what you would do. That's how I live. I trust myself. That's why it's easier when you trust yourself, you'll believe what you see and you'll go with what you know. You won't doubt yourself when you trust yourself. You are so different from anyone around me. Energy. Hmm. Life without you. Hopeless, dark, and depression. I miss you. Why is it that I love that you love me? That's what this person wanna know or what you wanna know. Who wouldn't love this collective, huh? If I could <clears throat> go back in time, I would use a different way to deal with our problems. Why can't I tell you the truth? Because they're not used to being honest. They think they're going to regret being honest. Because everything you say will be used against you. And they're scared that what they say can be used against them. My sister used to I am blocked. Huh. You probably blocked this person on your social media. Or you probably... Uh, this person probably feel blocked because they ain't karma. We didn't do that money yet, honey. Let me know if you want an injury with me. Twenty dollars. Turn it this way. <laughs> I don't know what I have with that. 
My sister used to always say, you always got some shit to say. I say, stop giving me shit to talk about. Y'all be on some, y'all be doing some stupid shit. And you only say something because you care. Yeah, job offers. What you need to be working on or getting or you will get if that's what you've been waiting on. Even when it comes to your own business, things will pop up, uh, start coming to a change. And you about to change a job offer. Or some job offers, you, offers you've been trying to get will come through. You stop overspending, but if you change, you might have to overspend. You change how you've been looking at jobs and how you've been spending, making huge decisions, came in reverse. So, like, again, that fell on the job offer. It's huge decision. You haven't decided yet, but you will. Yes, yeah, long denied. Came in reverse, huh? So, these people are changing because they're being denied. That's what interviews. So, people probably going on job interviews or looking for loans or asking for loans, and they're getting denied. Interviews, overspending. Yeah, background check came in reverse. So people already know kind of what you stand for. Making huge decisions. You don't have to worry about your background when you're going to look for a job. If that's what you worry about. Shopping came in reverse. So somebody got denied shopping or somebody, things are changing in their life where they getting denied or lost a job or they not making this much money where they can't go shopping no more. Background check. Somebody could be shopping around trying to get some information on you about how you make your money or watching you online. Cryptocurrency could be you could be into digital money but crypto could be just anything digital. They could be looking at how you dress trying to you know size you up See how much money you make. Yes, fell again. Confirmation. Now hiring. Fell on job offer. Come on in. <laughs> the price is right. Looking ass. That's what's up. God damn it. I'm keep messing with that light. We don't need it. This is shortage. Always something. It's all good. Yeah, so let's look at the past. This is just current energy. Bad business. Finishing what you started. It was hard for whoever this earth or water sign to finish what they started with this seven of pentacles. They wasn't getting lucky with that seven. It wasn't being uh, looking at what they invested in. It came in reverse. You was probably getting, giving yourself an equal give and take. You was a happy couple. Or they was a happy couple until business went bad. Or they start, was a happy couple, but they couldn't be financially uh, stable. They probably was a happy couple, but they uh, your person couldn't finish what they started. Hmm. Maybe your person couldn't keep a job. Ooh, what am I? I need to get another stack. One of my cards look like a damn... Like somebody bit it off of it. <laughs> yeah, they was going through bad luck even when they was happy and in love. This couple. They was in bad luck. They both was going through karma. So once again, friend one, they got through each other for the wrong reason. It's kind of like if you can't build by yourself, you're not going to be able to build with someone else. So you can stop looking for people to build with. They had a lack of control on welcoming changes. Yes, bad business for this couple. 
the lovers out here again. So you got a couple that got together that was in karma. Help trying to help each two broken people trying to help. Ignorant, trying to show off. So this couple was ignorant and always trying to show off, huh? And being reckless. Promises wasn't delivered in this relationship. God damn, so is giving it to us, huh? <laughs> While they was in karma, they had a lack of money, poor financial. So like I said, they just got together because they both were broke. They got together because they were lonely or something. They want to be a different person. Um, and then they they had, they had both were trauma bonded purpose personally. Probably, excuse me. With this uh, unhappy family life. Lack of stability and security. Dysfunctional family. So they both come from a dysfunctional family. One is a daredevil. What is this? Yeah. Outgoing. This was a um, uh, this shit was cause of fatigue. They looked at each other as a backbone, learning from each other's failure, gathering their strength together. So this person probably was using one person to do business with. And trying to be in a relationship with someone else at the same time. That's why they couldn't deliver much. So they had like someone they was in a relationship that probably their family knew. And then they were dealing with someone on the side. They was being reckless with and trying to show off. So that's what got them in karma. The other person could have been you. Someone they had to make a major choice. They could have been in the perfect union. They could have been perfect, but they were ignorant and acting reckless and trying to show the fuck off. Playing mind games. And it became an ongoing situation, a battle. Yeah, they was holding secrets, not using their intuition very well. Because they had a lack of money. And security. So they got with someone they was unhappy with. And then tried to act stupid and reckless with you. Because they didn't have money. So they was more secure hanging with the person that they didn't have money with. Because they probably didn't care what that person thought. And then they cared about what you think. So you made them feel some kind of way. <laughs> You know, they don't care about what the other person thinks. That's why they're more comfortable with them. They already have picked and poked and talked shit about them to make themselves feel better. And no matter how they talked about you or picked and poked at you, it didn't come out the same, boo. So they went with who made them feel better in this unhappy relationship or family dynamic. Mm -hmm. So let's pull out some current energy since I have time. That was current energy, but that was from earlier. So let's do some now. Someone feeling insecure, LGBTQ, what the fuck you do? You see those colors in reverse? Something that's not revolving, something that's not giving birth. Three, no support in reverse. Anxiety, you the subject of gossip. So you can have a bunch of females or men talking like women around you. But they're shitty moms, shitty dads. 
talking about you. But they have an anxiety with that Gemini communicating something. Maybe with this Emperor Empress in reverse, you're not being very nurturing. You releasing shit. Going through a power struggle. That's 14 swords already. There's 14. Go. Deliverance and salvation is what you're looking for. Because you're not getting no support. So you could be ca causing you... What situation in your life is creating fear and anxiety? Yeah, you're going through a power struggle. So it could be you going to the doctor by yourself or the dentist by yourself. Or you having to do something different. Like create... Build your confidence to go... Uh, pick up your last check to tell your boss that you don't like your schedule. It could be something you could be going through a power struggle with that you feel like you're not getting support with that three. And it's causing you probably not to be so nurturing. Yes. In the community, it's upside down. Or oh, this person is broke. So you could have a broke baby mama or somebody talking shit about you. Because they have no greatest accomplishments. Compliment, uh, accomplish. They haven't accomplished shit really in their lives. They could be broke or doing the same basic shit. Yes, this person with this 19 feel like things are coming to an end. Good luck and prosperity is coming to an end. 24 with this power struggle. So everybody is going through a power struggle and not being very nurturing. <laughs> yeah. 24. Both material and spiritual world. Spiritual being having a human experience. That's what y'all having. I'm trying to see. Uh, Sagittarius, you going through some kind of power struggle? And whoever, ooh, look at all these people talking shit. But you balancing shit. What situation in your life is asking you to have patience and determination? So don't be so hard on yourself. That you might have a lot of people talking shit about you in the community and they broke as fuck. And they insecure as fuck. This came in reverse. They probably got a nasty house. Talk to their kids all stupid. Not consistent. Only do what they see. They have no mind of their own. Yeah, these people could be catching anxiety because you looking like this here. You probably the subject of gossip. Maybe whoever this these two people are, this person, baby mama, baby daddy, or mother or father, they're going through a power struggle because shit came to an end between them. So they probably can't survive on their own without each other. And they barely was surviving when they was together. Yeah, what did I say? They fell under her. Empress, in, Emperor, in, or him. Emperor in reverse. They broke and they going through things. They doing the shit, a lot of shit on their own and they overwhelmed. So they since these people broke up, they wasn't doing good. Yeah, they wasn't doing good. <laughs> and she must have been doing most of the shit on their own. On her own. One world is upside down. Yeah, and you over there reflecting what's deep within your meaning. But you might be going through a little power struggle with it. Are you ready to rec be recognized for your effort and achievements? Yes. And I always tell people, if you got goals and shit and it don't make you cry or get frustrated, it ain't even worth doing. 
Nothing good is easy. Five, it's something that needs to change and be in motion when they come to you. And that could be you looking for a job offer or you having to do things on your own. You have to self-motivate yourself or keep rebuilding your confidence because you're going through different levels or different situations or having to just self-motivate. You might not have that many people around you to tell you, fuck them people, you go ahead and do what you need to do. Boom. Right? Like and subscribe. And I really do pre appreciate the ones that did. Yeah, I've been drinking a little bit. I'm Chardonnay. Yesterday I cooked some crawfish egg two face with with, with, uh, with some ball eggs and um battered shrimp. Yes, luck is gonna be on your side. And whatever you're trying to do, somebody else have a problem confused about their sexuality. That's why they coming at you like a sissy. And they'll be back. <laughs> if you even want them back. Your health is getting better when you go to the doctor or when you build that confidence or whatever it is you have to rebuild. Confidence come and go. You have to keep rebuilding it. Yeah, they confused with this air in reverse and they confused about how they communicate. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius is a, uh, uh, another fire sign. Could be Sagittarius, Aries, um... Sorry, I forgot the other one. Leo could be confused about their sexuality or the com the conversation is confusing because that's air, that's communication is confusing about their sexuality and they will be back. To, and you know what they, you have, let's see, you have probably people confessing or talking about their sexuality or confused but they not going through a breakup. They'll be back. So you can have a lot of men and women that like you. That's why they don't like you. You know, they got a crush on you. And they know they cannot get with you. That's what the fight could be within themselves. Or, um, no matter. Because you're going to be in this yes energy. Someone who's going to be coming back. Because they don't want to break up. And you're going to be feeling good about yourself. I don't give a fuck what community you in. Yeah, your heart's going to be open. You're going to be feeling good. And whoever's under this confusion with this air or this gossip is in reverse. Honeymoon came in reverse. There will be no wedding. Remember, that came in reverse. So it could be until you have a conversation, communicate, and stop being confused about this person's sexuality, there will be no motherfucking wedding. <laughs> But your heart will be open. Put a little love in your heart. And the world will be a better place. Somebody's going to want something new. Karma. Something in it. Something new about to begin. Okay. So wedding going to be in reverse until y'all both open up your heart. And I feel like this person that don't want to break up with you, that's what they're going to do. They're going to come back and want to start something new with you. And then you got don't worry about these people because they're all confused about their sexuality. They don't respect the opposite sex. They like to probably compete with the opposite sex. Or they know they're on the down low instead of out with their sexuality. Or regardless, they probably wasn't... Uh, they probably don't understand why they like a lot of porn or uh, why they have funny fetishes and shit like this. And they probably are addicted to sex or they just confused about their sexuality, just period. Ugh. That is so pathetic. Like, even if you are, like, put your fake boobs and titties or whatever you want to do and butt on and move to the other uh, levels of life instead of saying in this one zone about trying to prove if you gay or straight or should you come out the closet. It's like it's more shit to worry about in life. 
So, yeah, I feel sorry for them people that's just stuck on what they look like and what kind of car they drive. It's like, come on, we got other things we could be doing. The makeup and shit and the tennis shoes, it's all good, boo. Let me know what you're going through, and I'll hit you up later.